This is the world's biggest unsolved mystery. This place is called the Coral Castle, and it was built by one man in the 1920s. But how? To this day, no one knows how he built it, or why. It all started when a man named Edward Ledskelnin came to the United States from Latvia. He had a very strange appearance. It was only about 4 feet 11 inches, but he weighed nearly 300 pounds. And he had a long white beard that covered his entire chest. People called him the Wizard of the Everglades because of his incredible strength and knowledge of magnetism. He spent 28 years building the Coral Castle, but he didn't do it alone. He had an entire team of workers helping him, and they were doing something incredible. They were moving huge rocks and arranging them in very specific patterns, and all of this was done with primitive tools. There were no machines or explosives or cranes, and yet the rocks weigh several tons. How did they move these rocks without modern equipment? We don't know. There are other strange things about the Coral Castle, too. For example, there's this gate. It weighs about three tons. And according to the laws of physics, it should be impossible for it to swing like that. It's also possible to walk through this wall, even though it looks solid. If you knock on it, it sounds hollow. But if you look inside, there's nothing there. So how did he build the Coral Castle? Well, there are many theories. Some people say he used magnetic devices to levitate the rocks. Others say he built a series of tunnels underneath the castle that allowed him to move the rocks more easily. But these are just theories. No one really knows. And that's not the only mystery. There are also strange symbols carved into some of the rocks. These symbols are similar to ancient Egyptian hieroglyphs, but we don't know what they mean. And there are other carvings that resemble petroglyphs found in South America. How could a Latvian man in the 1920s have known about these ancient symbols? Again, we don't know. The Coral Castle was finally opened to the public in 1951, but only a year later, the government shut it down. They said the place was unsafe, but really they were worried that people would find out the secrets of the Coral Castle. And that's why today we don't know how it was built, or why. But if you visit the site today, you can still see the rocks and try to figure it out for yourself. Thanks for watching.